Thank you for tuning in to this coverage of the 2024 Turtle Island Crokinole Championship. This is the third Tier 1 tournament of the National Crokinole Association Tour. The 10th annual Turtle Island tournament saw a whopping 34 players signed up for the competitive division, nine of which moved on to the A pool of this tournament. These nine players included four of the top 10 currently ranked players, Connor Ryman, Andrew Hutchinson, Josh Carfiello, and Ron Langell. Other well-known names in the top nine included Jason Beerling, Jeremy Tracy, and Nathan Walsh. Two relatively new players to the scene who I believe we will be seeing a lot more of, Sean Haggerty and Ryan Burr. Of these nine competitors, four moved on to the semi-final round. Jason Beerling, Josh Carfiello, Connor Ryman, and Andrew Hutchinson. In our first semi-final match, which is out now on YouTube, we have Jason Beerling, currently ranked 13th in the NCAA standings, versus Josh Carfiello, currently ranked 4th. Jason Beerling is the most veteran of these four players, having been active since 1999. He has competed in a whopping 124 Crokinole tournaments. In his last three tournaments, of all the shots taken, 29.4% of his shots were converted into 20s. He is an eight-time World Crokinole doubles champion alongside his brother, Ray. That duo also placed first in the 2023 Ontario Doubles Crokinole Championship and the 2024 US Open. Up against him is Josh Carfiello, who, although has been active since 2010, only recently switched over from the Q's division. In just the last year alone, Josh Carfiello has managed to play second in the 2024 World Crokinole Championships, first in the 2023 Ontario Singles Championship, and fifth overall in the 2023 National Crokinole Association Tour. He has competed in 33 tournaments and of all the shots in the last three tourneys, converted 32.5% of those into 20s. This match is out now on YouTube, so make sure to watch that right away. And in our second semi-final match, we have Andrew Hutchinson, currently ranked third in the NCAA standings versus Connor Ryman, who is currently ranked first, tied alongside Justin Slater. Andrew Hutchinson has been active in Crokinole since 2013, having competed in 70 tournaments. Of all of his shots taken in the last three tourneys, he has converted 35.3% of those into 20s. He made the final four in the 2024 World Crokinole Championships, both singles and doubles. He placed second in the 2023 World Crokinole Championships and first in this year's Ontario Singles Crokinole Championship. Across the table from Hutchinson is Connor Ryman, who has been active since 2017 with 33 tournaments under his belt. In his last three tournaments of all shots taken, he converted 39.5% into 20s, which is perhaps why he is now a two-time World Crokinole Champion from the year 2023 to 24. He also placed second in the most current World Crokinole doubles alongside John Conrad and second in the 2023 National Crokinole Association Tour. This match is sure to be a doozy, so make sure to tune in Thursday for the second semifinal match. But before you dive into the Turtle Island Crokinole action, here are some upcoming National Crokinole Association events to look out for. First up, we have the first ever Dallas Singles Crokinole Tournament happening August 17th. You can tune in again to Tracy Board's YouTube to see the coverage from that event. Up next, we have the Crokinole World Cup in Budapest, Hungary, September 14th to 15th, featuring both singles and doubles play. Stay tuned to see where you can see coverage of that event. And finally, on the same day, September 18th, we have two tournaments happening at the same time, the Belleville Crokinole Challenge, as well as the Brooklyn Crokinole Championship. Tune into the Tracy Boards YouTube channel to see coverage of the Belleville Tournament, and tune into the Brooklyn Crokinole Club YouTube to see the Brooklyn Tournament. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and enjoy this coverage of the 2024 Turtle Island Crokinole Championship.